All right, we're here with Andrew Tennyson, obviously a fight of the night. Andrew, talk about tonight's fight. Well, it was fight of the night. I guess got to take your word for it. I haven't seen all the other ones, so. Well, I'll tell you what. Uh, I guess I want to ask you about the unorthodox cartwheel kick that you threw there. <laughs> Uh, what was that all about? The car wheel kick that didn't work. <laughs> you know, uh, you can be flashy, but if you don't set it up right, you know, it's pointless. But I have lots of work to do, and I was having fun, and my opponent was really good, so I ended up having to go with bread and butter jiu -jitsu. Going into tonight's match, the word is uh, your ground game. I thought your ground game was amazing tonight. Talk about that. Thank you. Um, well, I've been grappling for a while. I started grappling, you know, but... I'm a mixed martial artist, so I'm trying to work on everything. And I guess I just got you know him in a good position, and he was fighting out of lots of things. I thought I had um, an arm lock on him, but then he got out of that, so I ended up getting a choke. He was a, a great fighter, I thought. I thought he uh, gave you a really good match and a good fight. Talk yeah. about him a little bit. Um, as I said in some other interviews, uh, Santa Fe BJJ is a really good school. Quinn Mulvern fought in the UFC. He was out of there. They got um, Aaron Pearls, who's really good. And the coach up there, I've heard good things about him, too. So Santa Fe BJJ, they're good, you know. And um, Joel brought, Joel Whitney brought it tonight. So that's why I went to a second round. I found out your coach, and you were talking to a young man there, talking about not only winning the fight, but uh, how you conducted yourself afterwards, showing respect. Yeah, um, we're all in this to become better people, hopefully, and not just to hurt other people. I mean, this isn't a great way to make money, and so unless you're doing it for other people and to better yourself, you're kind of wasting your time here just being a bully. And so martial arts is about being a martial artist, and life should be about helping other people and growing. Awesome. Andrew, what's the future hold for you now? And Or is it too early to tell? It, well, it's way too early to tell. I, I do know what the future, near future is, and that's waffles with jam and maple syrup. Um, I got a waffle iron for Christmas. I haven't been able to touch it because I had to diet and make weight. So I'm really happy to be able to eat all the waffles I want now and get back. Awesome.